Hi, I'm Kazimir Noskowski, writer-director of The Outside Story, and I'm here with Tom Ryan, supervising sound editor and re-recording mixer on our film. Perfect. Tom, I loved working with you on the mix. How was it for you? You know, some of my favorite experiences in this industry as a whole are working with people like you who are very collaborative in the approach, and I think this was a very collaborative approach. I think you'd agree. How did you get into the audio world? This is something that's always was interesting to me. I remember being a child and hearing the Wilhelm scream in, in like Indiana Jones and, and then recognizing it in, you know, Empire Strikes Back. I'm like, what is that? <laughs> Why is it the same scream that was in that movie? I love foleying sounds. And the one, just one that sticks out to me is in the film is the chalk sounds on cement. Our Foley artist watching along with the chalk and, uh, and doing it on a, you know, to spec New York City sidewalk. Isn't it like under the floor? Yeah, we like we have a platform that opens up and then underneath that is all the, the various walking surfaces. So. Do you like working on naturalistic stuff like The Outside Story or do you prefer more stylistic mixing? I personally prefer more naturalistic things. Mm. With the stylistic, obviously you have creative license. I don't know what this spaceship sounds like. <laughs> but yeah. when you're doing a naturalistic thing, you're really trying to recreate reality in a way. What's the most quintessential New York sound to you? I mean, the overall din, I think, is just the thing that is so quintessential to New York, which when you leave it, you don't think about it, or when you're living in it so long, you don't think about it. But then when you leave it and things are a little quieter, it's a loud place. Din is a great word, by the way. Big fan of din. 